strange I came across. This is the King's of Rice. Saltzman. And this is MGC Cast. Go. Uh, another middle of the night recording. Um, so, um, two things. One less important than the other. Uh, the first one is, in, in many short terms, behold, official, official licensed Pokemon lingerie. So if you haven't noticed after that one, it's a Pokemon subject. Gay. This picture, this, uh, this Pokemon lingerie looks kind of funny, but whatever. So, um... I just need a girlfriend so I can have her model it for me. <laughs> so, on to, on to the more important of the two, or... Or less important, depending on who you are. Uh, well, yeah, I guess I guess you're right. So, do you remember? Do you remember what I was just talking about? Live action, live action movies. Yes. Now, wouldn't you believe right now there is a there's a there's a live action Pokemon movie right spitting war? Really? Oh yeah. I don't know how I feel about that. Honestly, dude, I said I I was I I was sitting in a car driving around all day, so like. I, I just couldn't imagine it. So it's like, you know, I, I, I happened to come, like, at at one of my stops, like, I was waiting for my uh, niece to get out of school, and, uh, and like, I was just, you know, cruising around Twitter like I usually do, and then I happened to see this article by Kotaku. So, basically, according to The Hollywood Reporter, the Pokemon Company has been meeting with Hollywood Studios to launch a big-screen live-action version of Pocket Monsters. The sources tell Hollywood Reporter that Legendary Entertainment could come out on top, beating out Warner Brothers for the rights, though Sony is also said to be interested. Huh. So, and it says, uh, the entertainment trade publication mentioned that the fact that Legendary is owned by China, China's uh, Delane Wanda group could also cause controversy because Japanese movies were banned in China for the past three years, but that's, you know... Um, interesting. So, wait. Okay. So basically, now, now moving on to the to our obvious to our obvious, uh, I guess you can say, uh, uh, fallback. Well, discussion. Yeah. So you know, it's like I already can't picture this. Or how they even would do this. Yeah. Um, basically, how would they present Pokemon? Like, how would they present them? Like, do you, like, are they going to be like, you know, how they, how they, uh, basically, like, let's just say, uh, except for like, what, what, like, are they going to do it like, are they going to design, are they going to do like redesigns and, you know, and then put it on the screen like that? Or are they going to do like CG versions of the Pokemon on screen, like, you know, say, like they did for, a similar fashion that they did for a mixture of cartoon and live action like they did for like you know space jam or something um like you know th there's so many like questions i'm gonna be honest this sounds like a terrible idea <laughs> i'm not gonna I'm lie to you. i'm sorry I, I, I just don't see Pokemon translating into a live action movie. I just don't see it. I mean I I I mean I'm I'm inclined to agree with you. It's weird it's weird. It's weird and it doesn't leave it doesn't leave us in a safe position because if it's bad it's going to be like it, it might just be it might just be the next the next Dragon Ball, you know, Dragon Ball Evolution bad. Oh, oh god. <laughs> Dragon Ball Evolution bad. Oh, but man. but another thing is like the 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 product the, the Hollywood studio that makes it could make a difference as well. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, because you know, I mean, who who has you know, wh which one of, which one of the three right now that they're talking about, uh -huh. like, has a better like track record with like, I guess you can say, movies that are basically gonna have CGI CGI in it. Um, you know, it, it really it really comes down to that track record. So what is it? Sony, Legendary, and, and uh, Warner Brothers. I mean, there's someone in the comments here that says, "I hope Warner Brothers gets it." I, I yeah, I guess Warner Brothers. 
would guess. I feel like whoever has the most money at their disposal. I mean, it's true, but like you know, I guess, I guess, in, I guess in the end, I guess the money is the real issue. But I want to say like the production itself, who they're even gonna get to play the cast, what story are they gonna be doing? Yeah, like I don't know, is it Pokemon, like big TV shows, Pokemon Origins, like what you know, like what is it? Like I, I just this sounds. I'm, I have no faith in this one. Now, now here's the thing, though, because like the thing is, like, the Pokemon Company has been meeting, so basically the company itself mm-hmm. is like, you know, is is down for this. So, you know, the question is, is like, what are they thinking about right now? Like, you know, Pokemon is continuing to be a cash cow, okay? Like, you know, the the juggernaut of the handheld gaming industry. Yeah. And you know a, a juggernaut. I guess I guess you can say in in a prospective area of the anime industry as well. And um, now you have to wonder, like they make they they release a movie like every year. They have to wonder what's in a Wonder Ball. Or they they at least they they release like one or two movies a year. So yeah. like, you know, you have to be wondering what's going through their minds right now. Like, <laughs> like you know. I'm sure this was a long board meeting. <laughs> yeah. Because you have to think about it. Because like, I, I guess I guess from a perspective of an American, it doesn't really work because you know they do a lot of live action in Japan all the time. Uh-huh. That apparently works. I can't I can't see it. And the whole thing, you know, with with um, now the weird thing is is like you know a, American adaptations of anime are getting a bad rap right now because of whitewashing. Okay, so. Well, I. Of like apparent whitewashing, I mean, don't like say whitewashing I in general. Pokemon, I don't think it'll be as intense because I don't think there's really like established. Gen uh, established race role. <laughs> yeah. Well, I well I guess because like, for us it's like it's Ash Ketchum, which is like. What Japanese person is named Ash Ketchum, right? Yeah, exactly. So <laughs> like, you know, whatever. Um. Like, I don't know. I guess for that for that type of live action, man. I guess for that type of movie, I guess Warner Brothers. I don't know. Part of me is in my mind, though, is like, well, Sony. Now let, let's hear this question though, because of because we know like what what Pokemon is geared towards, right? Yeah. Now the question is, of the three companies, like. Say like, are, would it would it be a mistake? Like, why do I get this feeling that they're gonna make it gritty? You know, gritty and kind of dark. I feel like, I feel like Warner Brothers wouldn't, but that's just me. Um. Yeah. Like, there's a there's a side of me that goes, oh god, they're gonna take this and make it like you know gritty and dark and like you know children are gonna be like, what the hell? Not word <laughs> yeah. for word, but well, actually, you know what? Maybe word for word. It's considering this generation likes to, you know, children are gonna be like, "What the hell?" Yeah. So, like, you know, there there are mistakes to be made here. Just, 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 there just are mistakes don't... that are gonna be made here. I think the... is more appropriate. Now, there there are mistakes to be made here. We're not talking about a short grenade toss. Yeah. So, like, we're talking about we're talking about it holding every explosive in Call of Duty in your hand at one time and having it go off. So, like. Well, you know, all, all, all doubts aside, I kind of want to, like, you know, I want to see how this hashes out, like, in the in the days to come, like, you know, the studio that they're going to choose, you know, and what the budget's going to be like. Because I only heard about this today, so, I mean, I don't know how old the news actually is. Like, the news as a whole, because, like, this article came out today, I'm pretty sure. Let me look, let me check the date on it. Yeah. Um, this is... Yeah, it's it actually was yesterday at four a.m. So yeah, it's it's from yesterday. <laughs> so because it you know currently it's past two thirty or when we're doing this recording two thirty in the morning of April sixteenth. So I mean, so yesterday. But like I said, I mean, mm-hmm. you know, right now, right now, most of us are most. Of, I mean, at least in my case, I'm focused. I'm more focused on the Ghost in the Shell live action. You know, but the, the, I guess you could say the controversy going around that. So this kind of shocks me. Um, 
So we'll we'll just I guess I guess in the I guess in the I guess the next couple of months we'll see what really goes down. Yeah, I mean, wow. Yeah, I'm just like I said, man. I don't know. How, I'm just I'm, I'm nervous. One for left field, right? Right. Wide right, Miami wins. Exactly. Um, Wide right, Miami wins. Um. God. Yeah. Like, what do you? Like, what do you say to something like this? Hey, we're gonna make a live action Pokemon movie. What? We're gonna make a live action Pokemon movie. Uh... I'm telling you, the the kids. I'm gonna say that the younger the younger generation might not understand, but what we were like, you know. But I I'd like to imagine the shocks the most is the is is the generation that you know that got the start of it. So like, we're over here like. I'm not saying destroyed childhoods or nothing because, you know, I had a fulfilling childhood when it came to Pokemon. So, um, my adulthood might be destroyed. I don't know. <laughs> hey, your, adulthood, your adulthood might be destroyed. My Pokemon adulthood might be destroyed. I might have not ever be. A, well, no, it's not, it's not going to affect the way I feel about Pokemon in general. I just might, you know, I just might, I just might think a little bit critically about Pokemon company. Um, but yeah, I guess we'll just see how this hashes out in the next few months or to a, to a year, I guess. I want to say, give it six months. Yeah. At least at, at the most, I mean, well, at the most a year, give it at least six months and we'll see, we'll see if any relevant, uh, uh, you know, information comes out. So, uh, like, comment, subscribe, dude. Tell us what the fuck is going through your mind. Like you know, tell us tell what the it, tell us what the fuck is going on right now. Tell us how bad of an idea you think this is on a scale of one to ten. I'm 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 going at a full nine here. <laughs> I'm going to full nine. I'm going negative eleven. I'm not worried at all. No, I'm just joking. Right. <laughs> yeah, right. right. You 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 trust you trust very well, sir. Yeah, right. Um, like again, you know. We, we want to hear from we want to hear from you hopefully you know we have some insightful insightful people coming in so with that said this is the kings of rice this is peace out